Tesla workers are talking about UAW representation next on your Labor Minute. Hello, I'm Mark Harrison. The United Auto Workers Union has confirmed that workers from the Tesla assembly plant in Fremont, California, have approached the union. Tesla Chief Executive Elon Musk told the website Gizmodo that the lead contract between the UAW and Tesla workers, Jose Moran, didn't really work for Tesla, that he worked for the UAW. In fact, Moran has been with Tesla since 2012, often working 12-hour days, six days a week. This move is bringing to light the long hours that plant employees are having to work along with mandatory overtime and preventable workplace injuries that have been sustained. Tesla is in the process of increasing production to 500,000 units in 2018, up from just 100,000 last year, and with a goal of producing a million electric vehicles a year by 2020. In a post on the website medium.com, Mr. Moran said he's been a proud team member at the plant for more than four years, but that more needs to be done to improve circumstances of the fast-growing operation, adding that pay at the plant averages $17 to $21 an hour, well below the $25 plus an hour for comparable workers in his industry, and that the cost of living in Silicon Valley is more like $28 an hour. Of note, Tesla has begun asking its employees to sign a confidentiality agreement intended to prevent them from publicly discussing wage and working conditions a move that drew fire from several state legislators in California for not adhering to state and federal labor policy rules. I'm Mark Harrison with Labor Minutes.